my future is unlimited and I've just had a vision almost like a prophecy I know it seems truly crazy and yes the vision's hazy but I swear someday there'll be a celebration throughout Oz that's all to do with me if you've seen the musical wicked you know that Elphaba the wicked witch has been born different from all of us she's green and in one of the tunes of the musical she's heard about the wizard and is hoping that the wizard can help her find positivity, change her life, be different from what she is. Well, in this episode of Seize the Day, no, we're not talking about being green, but we are talking about how when we feel isolated or when we feel different or when we feel frustrated, we can try to see below the chaos of the storm and see what shimmers. So today, Diana's going to give us a tip about um, looking below the chaos of the storm. Thank you, Lee. You know, while we really can't calm the storm ourselves, we can work on calming ourselves. Um, for many people, though, that can be quite difficult. You know, the storm is a raging and, and the worry right now and people not knowing and not knowing when the storm will pass. Um, it's important to acknowledge our feelings, to accept that they exist, and to notice when we may be leading to some unhelpful um, behaviors. And so at that point, we may want to think about what other choices we may want to make. Um, when it comes to looking at various behaviors that may be more beneficial for us. Realizing that it may be okay to let go and focus on the present. And really, what's happening right now in the present is what we have control over. How we think about and how we view the present. And in this moment, I'm fine, I'm okay. And it may be important, I say that to myself. I sometimes will go, you know what? It's okay, take a deep breath. All is well. My family's okay. I'm okay. In this moment, we're okay. It also then gives us a little bit of control to potentially look at making some different choices. We've got freedom now to potentially maybe be creative and innovative. This whole project is creative and innovative, and certainly for me, stepping outside of the box. It um, can, can help us to gain some clarity and some stability and feel more centered. And one of the ways that I know I'm able to do that is through breath. And it's important to breathe through your diaphragm. Um, I'm going to suggest that you either do a seven, five, seven. So you're going to inhale seven breaths and then hold for five and then exhale for seven. And you may want to think of something where I'm bringing in positive energy and I'm letting go of things that no longer serve me. If seven, five, seven doesn't really work for you, you might try five, three, five. But it's important to essentially take in those breaths. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then hold for five, and then be able through your mouth or through your nose to be able to exhale. Do it three times. That may help to settle you down and help you to ride the waves of the storm. If you're still finding that you have times when the storm is getting the better of you and you call upon supports that you have in your own natural environment and it's still finding that it's difficult to be able to calm yourself down and find those helpful behaviors, Memorial Health System has set up an, an emotional support line and we have professional counselors from 8 in the morning until 8 at night seven days a week and the phone number is 217-588-5509 and they're available to talk with you seven days a week from eight in the morning until eight at night so please reach out and call if you're needing it thank you
Did that really just happen? Have I actually understood? This weird quirk I've tried to suppress or hide is a talent that could help me meet the wizard if I make good. So I'll make good. Once I meet the wizard, once I prove my worth, once I meet the wizard, what I've waited for since, oh, since birth, well, with all his wizard wisdom, by my looks, he won't be blinded. Do you think the wizard is dumb? Or like Munchkin, so small-minded? No, he'll say to me, I see who you truly are. A girl on whom I can rely, and that's how we'll begin. The wizard and I. When I meet the wizard, my whole life will change. Cause when you're with the wizard, no one thinks you're strange. No father is not proud of you. The wizard you claimed And this gift or this curse I have inside Maybe at last I'll know why When we walk hand in hand The wizard and I And one day he'll say to me Alphaba A girl who is so superior Shouldn't a girl who's so good inside Have a matching exterior Folks round here to an absurd degree seem fixated on your vertigree. Would it be all right by you if I degree and if I you? Oh, that's not important to me. All right, why not? I'll reply, and that's how we'll begin. The wizard and I. Oh, what a pair! My future is unlimited And I've just had a vision almost like a prophecy I know it seems truly crazy And yes, the vision's hazy But I swear someday there'll be A celebration throughout Oz That's all to do When people see me, they will scream, for part of Oz is great. Thank you very much, Mary Kate, for that spectacular performance. And thank you for tuning in to our latest episode of Seize the Day. We'd like to encourage you to like our Hoagland Facebook page and also to tune in to our next episode on Facebook, YouTube, or on the Hoagland website at hcfta.org. So until we can meet again in the theater, I'm Gus Gordon encouraging you to seize the day and stay healthy.